Many people are familiar with the racist reactions to the casting of Rue in the movie adaptation of Suzanne Collins' The Hunger Games. People are less familiar, however, with the way the main character of the novel and movie, Katniss, was whitewashed. Though Katniss is described in the novel as olive-skinned with dark hair and dark eyes, a white actress, Jennifer Lawrence, was cast to play her in the film adaptation. But the whitewashing of Katniss began even earlier, as demonstrated by some of this fan art which appeared before the casting of Lawrence. In the Harry Potter books, Angelina Johnson is described as a tall, attractive black witch, not an insult, with long, dark hair worn in many braids. This is how the movies portray her. Given such unambiguous source material, fans imagine an adult Johnson would look like this. And her child, of course, would be a clone of his white father. This is how Korra from Legend of Korra appears in her source material. And the fan art. These fans like a woman of color character, when she's white. There are blogs fighting back against this pop culture whitewashing, such as Damn, Lay Off the Bleach, which is, in the blogger's own words, here to fuck shit up and shake the racist foundations of several fandoms. There are also blogs specifically devoted to fighting whitewashing in the few examples we've mentioned here. Media already erases people of color, and women of color especially. If you see someone whitewashing one of the already underrepresented characters of color in the, their fan art, Call them out.